Hi guys, it's Chris from GuitarFella.com and it's the first in a new series of online lesson reviews. Today we're taking a look at Justin Guitar. Now, hang on, we're reviewing a free site? The short answer is yes. Uh, does that mean we're going to review all the free sites, all the free YouTube videos? The short answer there is no. However, despite being completely free to use, Justin Guitar is one of the oldest and most complete free guitar lesson sites out there and certainly justifies its time in the spotlight. We'll get on to how you can help out the site financially later on in this video, but for now, let's take a closer look at what's on offer. Now, Justin Guitar was established in 2003. Over 16 years later, it remains one of the most popular free lesson sites around, with over 1,000 combined lessons, as well as some pretty good dedicated courses and loads of reference material. The first question, who is Justin? He's this guy. Hey, how you doing? I'm Justin Sandico and I created Justin Guitar way back in 2003 to bring top quality free guitar lessons to anyone that wants to learn to play guitar. I'm going to tell you all about it in just one minute. So, if you hadn't already guessed from the accent, Justin is an Australian guitarist. Uh, he's very experienced, he's written and produced for artists such as Katie Melua, and uh, he's played with countless original and cover bands around the world. He's always wearing his trademark flat cap, uh, he's a likeable guy, very engaging and easygoing. He teaches things clearly and ultimately learning with him is a nice experience. From time to time he invites some other artists to help him out with different videos, but generally it's just Justin. So, if you like Justin, you'll love Justin Guitar. So on to the design of the site, and in early 2018, Justin Guitar had a huge revamp. Uh, it had a new simple colour scheme and just became easy to navigate. Instead of the previous sidebar menu, everything is now accessed from a streamlined menu at the top of the page. The lesson pages themselves are also quite clean and easy to navigate, quite similar in layout to what you'd find on leading tutorial sites like Guitar Tricks and Jamplay. On the lesson page you'll find the video lesson itself, as well as some accompanying tips and text including notes on the song and the chords used. You may have noticed that Justin Guitar uses YouTube as the platform, meaning the video player is incredibly simple and very familiar to use. Hey, you're using it now. Uh, it has a full list of functions, this includes things like full screen, speed settings and subtitles, things that come standard on YouTube. It lacks the polish and features of some other dedicated video players, but YouTube is still a pretty good platform. To us, it's the filming of the videos that's probably the biggest giveaway that this is a free site. Unlike some others, there's no pristine studio, crystal clear audio or multiple camera angles. Just Justin sitting wherever he is that day playing his guitar and showing you what to do. However, the newly filmed videos, such as this one, are a better quality and include things like interactive on-screen tabs and chord progressions. So things are getting better. So what does it have to offer beginners? There's plenty to get to grips with. Justin Guitar offers a complete course for newbies featuring nine main stages with more than 100 video lessons in total. This course starts with the essential basics like the guitar's anatomy and how to tune the instrument. Then it moves you through stages of learning simple chords and power chords, a few picking exercises, how to organize a practice schedule and things like that. There's also a handy grading system which works from white, the easiest, through to black, the hardest. There's a full explanation of the grading system on the website, so check it out before you start, especially if you are a complete beginner. Now, despite being free, there is actually some decent content for intermediate players with many song and technique lessons. For example, there's an intermediate foundation course, as well as further intermediate models, teaching everything from those tricky bar chords to playing scales with a metronome. Hungry for more? Well, you can move on to advanced modules, but this is where the site falls a bit short compared to others. There's certainly stuff for advanced players, but as you can see, the list is still being worked on. It's okay, but not great. Want to skip the techniques and theory and just dive into a few songs? No problem, because there's a very respectable collection of songs to learn on the site. You have everything from Elvis to ACDC. There's a quick search function allowing you to search for, uh, let's say, Iron Maiden. Okay, one song, but still, it's a decent system. You can also search for songs by their levels, which is why it's worth going through that colour-coded grading system I originally mentioned. Or you can search for genres, like Christmas songs or songs which only use two or three chords. Overall, not the most comprehensive song catalogue, but for a free site, it's pretty good. Aside from songs and techniques, there's some other stuff worth mentioning. There's a decent reference section with items that will help you develop as a guitarist. 
There are reference pages on scales, chords and arpeggios, as well as pages that cover guitar gear, including pedal boards and tone settings. You'll also find some useful printable PDFs of blank chord boxes, blank manuscripts and blank tab pages, very handy when noting things down. There's also the newer musicianship section, which unfolds into several lesson pages, all focusing on the theory side of things. This is a useful feature for those wanting to go deeper into their guitar playing. This section will give you the lowdown on topics such as writing a song or producing a track. You'll also find complete courses on things such as music theory, technique and ear training. Now these are free to use, although as I'm about to mention, there is a charge for progressing past grade 2 in the theory course. I mean, he has to make money somehow and uh, this is a fair way for him to do so. On that note, you can contribute to the site by checking out the online store. This sells things like songbooks, DVDs, clothing and accessories, allowing you to contribute to the site financially in return for something physical. You can also just randomly donate a little cash if you feel the site has helped you in some way. As I've mentioned, some paid for lessons on music theory have been added to the site. While the early stages are free, grades 3 onwards are only accessible after a small payment of $9.99 for 6 months or a new $99 fee for lifetime access. Worth paying if you're serious about the theory side of things. Justin puts a lot of work into the site and it hasn't gone unnoticed with endorsements from the likes of Mark Knopfler, Tommy Emmanuel, Brian May and Steve Vai to name a few. Lessons tend to be added weekly with around 10 to 15 new lessons per month. Pretty good going for one guy. Ultimately, there are many free tutorial sites online today, where experienced and professional guitarists share video lessons with fans for absolutely nothing in return. But none of them are quite as extensive or committed as Justin Guitar. The amount of lessons for all abilities is, is just insane, and the reference material and extras make the site feel very complete. The list of songs is good, and the format, while a little rough at times, is very user-friendly. It may not have the refined feel of guitar tricks or the huge range of teachers like jam play, but Justin Guitar is a winner for beginners who want to progress on the guitar using free instruction. That's it from me today. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and head over to guitarfella.com for all the reviews, tips and opinion you need. See you next time.